In this video, we'll look at the Thonny editor and MicroPython. Thonny is an integrated development environment, or IDE, for programming your Raspberry Pi Pico, which uses the popular programming language, Python. The Thonny IDE enables beginners to program a Raspberry Pi Pico using MicroPython. MicroPython is a stripped down version of the Python 3 programming language. It includes a subset of the Python standard library and is optimized to run on microcontrollers like the Raspberry Pi Pico. To add MicroPython to your new Raspberry Pi Pico, simply connect the Pico to your computer with a micro USB cable. The Pico will open as a folder on your computer and then you can double click the file called index. This will open the raspberrypi.org getting started page in your browser. Scroll down until you see the tab getting started with MicroPython. Click this and then click the download UF2 file button. Once the file is downloaded, simply drag and drop the UF2 file onto the RPI RP2 drive. Your Pico will now reboot and be running MicroPython. You can download Thonny at thonny.org. Click the download link at the top of the page, choose your operating system, and double click the installer package. Once Thonny is installed, you won't need anything else to program your Raspberry Pi Pico except the Pico itself, a USB socket, and a micro USB cable. Thonny has a simple, uncluttered interface and only the essential features needed so users are not immediately overwhelmed by a complicated interface. Writing or pasting code into the console is simple. Code is easy to load, save, and run. Thonny works with Windows, Linux, and Mac operating systems. Built-in debugging highlights syntax errors, explains scopes by highlighting variable occurrences, and helping you to spot typos in the code. The Thonny IDE editor is great for MicroPython and beginners on the Raspberry Pi Pico.